Hey what's good guys this Arman here back with another video and welcome to my first tutorial video about low poly in photoshop. So let's get started shall we. With photoshop cc 2017 and basically this is called low poly. So it's some it looks something like this where you actually create a bunch of uh, polygons essentially triangles. So let me show you uh, some other examples. So if I just quickly go to Safari that one I actually made on my own so if I just type low poly there you go okay so as you can see low poly can be made in two dimension and three dimension as well so this one is in three dimensional today we are going to actually deal with two dimensional so this is a good example right here so this guy must have taken a normal picture of this guy and then used photoshop added in a bunch of triangles or other polygons and made it a really cool picture oh that's the same picture <laughs> so this is again a 3d model and uh, this is another 3d model so basically what you do is you take normal pictures and then turn them uh, into your art with the help of a bunch of polygons essentially your triangles again so the basic thing that you have to remember is that if you want to show details you have to go with small polygons like you if if you would see the, at this area the triangles are pretty small so that so that's where you can actually see the button the bell details over here the blade phantom blade and all of that you can actually see the details you can make out differences between things however if you would see this region the triangles are fairly big and you cannot actually see the details I actually uh, realize that later but never mind so basically uh, you have to decide on your own that where you have to go with more detail and where you have to go with less details so if we just get started I'll just quickly open Photoshop right here and then you can get an uh, by the way you can just get a normal picture from uh, Safari so if I just quickly type some kind of I'm not downloading it I've already downloaded it just for presentation purposes okay so you can get any one uh, any of these whichever you like so okay so I have downloaded one it's this just a second yeah it's this okay so yeah this I have already done this but just to show you a before and after thing alright so first you wanna place your picture and then select magnetic lasso tool. magnetic lasso tool and before you jump right in just make sure that your anti alias is off okay so now what you want to do is double click this layer over here to actually start editing it now you have to zoom in and out from your picture right so just press command plus and if you do it several times it will zoom further control minus or command minus if you want to zoom out so basically what you want to do is just a bit more okay so basically what you do want to do is you just want to create a polygon just like that okay so once you are done with this it uh, gives this animated border which actually makes you sure that it's uh, an enclosed figure now you want to go to your filters tab so you want to go to blur and go to average so what it is actually doing is it's taking the average of whatever color there is and then putting it constant in the whole of the polygon so that is what you essentially do in low poly it's a fairly simple art but again it takes time because if you want to show more details you have to take more time go with smaller polygons zoom in and then just work it out so I'm not going to show the whole process but I'm just going to show you just a bit so that you get some kind of idea select and yeah it might seem a bit pixely but um, that's all because we have zoomed in so much so basically it will it will just uh, it you won't be able to see it because when we export it finally 
uh, we'll actually won't see it this close right so that's gonna not be visible you want to take average and that's what you want to essentially do now just in case you make a mistake like you probably go like that okay just a second what the hell is happening yeah so probably you don't want this triangle probably you wanted this point to be here so you just want to hit ctrl z so okay so you just want to do that ctrl z triangles all right and then you want to take average oh my god okay so it's already done so actually that is how you supposedly do it and so basically you if you just do this so if you just go on doing this see if you just zoom out just a bit so all those details won't be visible at all uh, so eventually you do all these and you will end up uh, making your picture look like this so this was my first tutorial on photoshop let me know in the comment section down below how was it uh, should i even do it <laughs> and yeah thanks for watching peace